So I've had a lot of people ask me if I've considered doing a carbon roof on my GTIR. Um, I'm going to explain to you why that's kind of a difficult thing to do on older cars like this. And I mean, it's it's been done before. I've seen one other guy do it, but there's a specific way you have to do it. And in order for it to look right, this is how it has to be done. All right. So if you look at the factory roof panel on a Pulsar, it's got a roof line where these rain rails are here that's actually kind of a false line. Um, that is not the seam of the roof panel. The roof panel actually comes all the way down and the rear quarter window sills are part of it. Now, if you follow this, um, your rain rails, they have uh, pinch welds in here. It's part of the roof panel. And then that seam kind of comes down here around here and it you can see it it's right here and then it comes all the way over to here and then there's another seam that goes right here and this is actually the factory roof seam right here where it meets the quarter panel and from the factory the quarter panel is brazed to the roof panel along this seam um, it also comes back goes around here and here's the seam here and this whole piece back here is actually part of the roof panel, which it's also spot welded to the back of the car here, okay? So here's the issue with making a carbon roof on this thing. Well, obviously, if you brought the carbon down to right here, you're not gonna be able to braze steel to carbon fiber. That's just not gonna work. Um, you could try to get this joint really clean and bring the carbon up to here and make a really nice straight cut after the resin's cured and everything and then attempt to bond it to the steel, but that wouldn't be very strong. So what you would have to do is actually go past this a little bit by a couple inches. You'd have to overlap the quarter panel and then where the transition was between steel and carbon, it would have to be filled, sanded, locked down. And in order for this to look right, if you wanted a bare exposed carbon roof, um, you know, obviously this whole piece here would be carbon fiber, but from, from the rain rail down this whole section here would have to be painted the body color and only this piece left carbon fiber for it to look right. You know, um, obviously it would come down to this seam too and be tucked behind the windshield where the spot weld seam is. Um, it can be done, but it would be a incredibly cost prohibitive and uh, honestly this is going to be a street car and it's going to have a headliner in it so you know what would be the point of having a carbon roof for I mean I'm not going to say no weight savings but it would be a little bit minimal and really wouldn't make sense for a street driven car because you know you look underneath and you look at the roof panel you're never going to see that when a headliner is in place so no i'm not going to do a carbon roof it's just going to stay steel and you know this this joint is going to be properly brazed and set up exactly how it came from the factory so hope that explains that